everyone i am dr sharbani from shikha rai hospital senior consultant today i am going to discuss about trachoma so what is trachoma trachoma is an infectious eye disease which is a leading cause of preventable blindness worldwide so coming to the cause of trachoma what are the causes Trachoma is basically an infection which is caused by bacteria Chlamydia trachomatis. It can uh, spread uh, through contact with uh, discharge of nose or eye of infected person. Any kind of towels, uh, handles, hand, clothing can also cause transmission of this infection. In developing countries, even eye seeking flies can cause transmission of this disease. So, uh, the risk factors for this disease are overcrowding, poor sanitary conditions. because in case of overcrowding there is greater personal contact which causes increased risk of transmission of the disease also poor sanitary conditions inadequate access to water lack of hygiene face and hand hygiene practices poor if are there and also flies and insects can cause transmission of trachoma from one person to another coming to the symptoms of trachoma Uh, we should know that the symptoms can be uh, variable it can vary from uh, very mild symptoms like itching discharge little pain uh, to severe redness eyelid swelling and in advanced cases it can cause decrease in vision leading to even blindness so how to tackle trachoma we should first know what are the stages of trachoma for that in the initial stage it is there is follicular inflammation where there are small follicles or bump like structures on the inner portion of the upper eyelid uh, which can cause little uh, itching or discomfort in the eye in the second stage is uh, intense inflammation where there is severe redness and a pain associated with eyelid swelling can be there In the third stage what happens due to repeated infection and inflammation there is scarring in the inner portion of the upper eyelid which can be visible as white lines on examination in the fourth stage there is a severe uh, scarring which causes trichiasis that is the eyelashes turn inwards and they keep rubbing the corneal surface which can lead to uh, advanced cases of uh, corneal opacities in the fifth stage and the final stage so uh, these symptoms will also vary according uh, to the stage of the disease in early stages it will be mild symptoms and in advanced cases there can decrease vision associated uh, with other problems like redness pain and later on it can lead to blindness also so how to tackle uh, trachoma how to prevent trachoma and treat trachoma for that uh, the who has devised this strategy which is safe strategy s a f e to prevent and control trachoma s stands for surgery surgery is uh, for the advanced cases where there is eyelid scarring there is trichiasis and there is corneal opacity where surgery is needed then a for antibiotics to prevent and control infection f is for facial hygiene and e for environmental factors control like control of flies insects good hand hygiene practices to provide providing adequate water and control of sanitary conditions and control of overcrowding so all these factors if we keep in mind then we can prevent transmission of trachoma and also treat the cases of trachoma in their early cases stages and prevent blindness thank you